Good evening, YouTube. I'm in the Dane View area. Just doing a little nighttime video. It's pretty late at night. Obviously, nobody's out right now, but I did videos of this area before on Cambridge. That's straight is. Let's go further up. Dayton View Historic Area. I'll, show, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you where to turn at. Yeah, there was a house fire a street over from here on Lexington Empty Lot where a house used to be at. This street does not look in as bad a shape as Lexington does, but... Yeah, go straight. Straight, go straight. Yeah, you could tell there used to be a big apartment building right there, and probably right there too, where those big, all these empty lots, there used to be homes and apartment buildings there. Yeah, keep going straight. Yep, you could see where a lot of these empty lots were. There used to be homes that go. This is Lexington. No, uh, go left and then go. No, right, I meant right. We'll be coming around that in a second. Yeah, you could see where all these empty. You'd think this, this, this was probably a school. I don't know what school it used to be, but it was. You can tell by the size of the lot there, that's where a school used to stand at. Yeah. We'll uh, find the next street and then turn left and cut over to Lexington that way. Nice houses around here. Oh, yeah. I mean, this used to be an area, I've showed this area before, but. This used to be an area where a lot of money used to be at in the city of Dayton. Go and turn uh, left. Yeah, turn left here. Yeah, smart. Yeah. Yeah, turn it on to Princeton. Yeah, parts of this is still pretty nice yet, but it's... Now which way? Go up one more. Okay. And then turn left here. That'll take us close to the area that I wanted. Oh, yeah. These homes in New York or Boston... Now, yeah. Now what way? Straight, actually. Go straight. Yeah, these houses in New York or Boston would be worth millions of dollars in New York or Boston, no doubt about it. Do people ever write comments about this stuff? Oh, yeah. Do they ever turn in videos themselves? There are people, people watch and share. Yeah, go up. So, uh, so they put stuff back on too? Oh yeah, people write comments and people share the videos. Or do they put videos on themselves? Oh yeah, there are people that watch their put their own videos on there. But they put it on your thing? No. They post it on their own channel. Oh yeah, this yeah this yeah this right here is not bad right here. 
These houses you could probably get for 40 to 70 right here because they're not very big. Uh, go left down ever or actually 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 go up one more because it the area that I want to start on Lexington's just over that way yeah not bad houses people there's some still some good houses I mean this street looks pretty good I don't see any abandon on this street Vancouver and Princeton That house I can't tell I don't think anybody's living in that one anymore uh, Left Left Yeah, yeah We'll go I, I I know the way to cut over there Yep, this is Philadelphia Still in the date view Area this is the edge of it right here I go ahead and turn left right here at Haver Hill. This is the way to go down there. Yeah, these houses right here, despite a couple bars on the windows, actually look pretty good. Uh, slow it down here. Uh, turn. Yeah, yeah, you turn down this way. Yeah, now, now this street does not look in that bad a shape. This is Glenica, I believe. Now, though, there's one that's abandoned right there, that white one. Can't tell if the one next to it's occupied, but... There's another one. Well, yeah. Yeah, that uh, empty lot, undoubtedly, where another house used to stand that. Go further. Go around this way. Yeah, Boxford and Glenica, I think. Platt Drive. There's one empty right there. A few of these are still occupied. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Plus, part of. Watch out for the speed bump here. That one looks like, yeah, that one that's not being lived in. It was at one point in time, not so much need. No, no, turn left. This is the beginning of Lexington. All right, we're on to Seneca and Lexington. This is undoubtedly one of the more depressed streets in the area. Nope, nobody lives in that one, I don't think. Nope. I've showed this street a few different times and there was a house fire over here recently. Somebody lives in that one and in that one. Empty lots where houses and apartments used to stand. Somebody was working on this one or the one down the street, but I don't know if they still are. Apartment building where it's vacant. Another empty house, big beautiful house, what a shame. Yep, it's really bad through here. What's the news people saying about it? They don't put enough spotlight on this. Hey, they, they, it looks like somebody is living here. Looks like somebody moved in it and fixed it up. You see a car here. Wish it was during the Sorry, daytime to show it. Accident. Yeah. So I'm glad to see somebody's fixing it up, you know. Yeah, United Missionary Baptist Church right here. Yeah, you see an empty lot where used to be a house right there. Another one. Yep, another abandoned one. Empty lots where there used to be houses at. They're trying to raise these, but there's just so many of them on this street. Here, turn your head. Hide your face. Yeah. Hide your face. Put your Don't head. worry about it. 
We gotta let him go. Go ahead. Yeah, a couple quarter carryouts that have been closed. Water is coming up behind us. Don't worry about it. Empty house right there. Another one that's empty. There was one here on one of these corners that caught on fire the other night. Empty lot where... Church, turn your head. You don't want these people to... Yeah. Catalpa right here, it was slowed down. This it was Catalpa. It, it was right on this... One of these houses, I think, on Catalpa right here. It could, it could could have been this. No, it, it's not that one. This is Catalpa. Yeah, there was a house that caught on fire the other night. Right, there's yeah. one. That's yeah, that caught on fire the other night. So just another to the long list. Okay. Empty crack lot where a house used to be. There, 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 there's another tear down right there. This white one might be able to be saved. But this one right here is probably a tear down too. Yeah, it's hard to say if it's that now that second white one that so could that be saved yeah they probably ransacked that yeah empty lot where there used to be a house another empty apart an empty lot empty house empty lot there too another yep another abandoned one yeah, there's like 20 or 30. They tore down several of them, but there's just so many. They got to tear down. It's just a, yeah, empty lot where a house used to be. There's another one abandoned. Yeah, this street is extremely, this street is extremely depressing. Seeing this neighborhood in this shape. Yeah, you could tell a couple more empty lots where homes used to be there. There's another one that's abandoned. Empty lot again. That's not a bad look. Yeah. Place. Look at the windows in that. Yeah, it looks like somebody walked away from that one. That doesn't look like a bad house. Yeah. This one's been walked away from too. Looks like that one. Yeah. That's a historical valley. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Well, look, well this. Look, look at the side windows. See yeah. The oh yeah. This well, this is a historic district. Yeah. Here's another empty house right here. This is just really depressing that's like 15 or 20 just on the street yeah well they've oh yeah well they've tore down several of them and there's another empty lot that one looks like somebody's still living in it there's another one that's empty right there at the corner of Lexington and Bryan Manor yeah this one over here is abandoned too. Yeah, there's like 20 to 30 abandoned houses on this street. Yep, there's another one right here that's abandoned Come too. On, Mark. I lean over where I can see it. Yeah, there's uh, somebody lives in that one. The one next to it's not being lived in. What are we calling? What are we approaching? We'll be back on Salem, so we're almost done. Yeah, this is... What, up ahead of Salem? Not far at the end of the street, yeah. Well, what road is this? Broadway, go straight to Salem. We really took a long way around it. Oh, well. Looks like somebody doing some landscape in there. The one house back there looks pretty neat. Oh, yeah. I mean, there still is a few of those houses that could be saved. It's just a matter of getting a hold of one of them, you know. There's another one that's abandoned, beautiful house, too. There's a nice house here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there's some beautiful homes here. Another one right there that's really nice. So is that one. That's a nice house. Look at this one, Mark. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now that's one that probably could be saved. 
that big place there. Yeah. Yeah, you can tell at one point in time this was a really nice area. Yeah, somebody still lives in that red one across the street. Yeah, now this one's abandoned. Oh man, if somebody, I seen the window open on that one too. If it was during the daytime, I would have a look at the inside of that. That's a neat house here. Yeah. Now this used to be a lodge right here, Lexington Lodge. I don't know what it was used for back then, what kind of lodge, but. We're by the Dayton Police here. Yep, right over there. Okay, now which way do we need to go? Right. All right, YouTube, that's it for this one from Dayton View, Lexington area, through the University Row and Southern Dayton View area.